was the fellow with the wedding. Sea Marks is a story that came before there was such a thing as email, before there was Twitter. Uh, it was about somebody who was sitting down and writing a letter. I'm Xanthi Albright and I'm playing the role of Timothy Styles. My name is Patrick Fitzgerald. I play a character called Cullen Primrose. This lonely fisherman off the coast of Ireland who met somebody at a wedding by accident and then began to write letters. So it was just the power of words trying to woo her heart. And it worked. It's a love story about an accidental poet and an accidental publisher. He wrote to me so beautifully that I just became hypnotized by his words. My darling Timothea, I make this a short letter because... As I can see through the pain that the moon has settled and the night has almost run out. I wanted to ask you, did you know about a relation of yours who's getting married here? You see, there's a wedding plan between Ernestness Terence Feeney, known as Red Ernest, and Maggie Swan, who is your third cousin. It's to be at the heads in September. Think of that. He's a lonely fella, Colm. He spent a lot of time fishing, not much time courting. Timothea Stiles. She's a driven, um, energetic woman who has big dreams and is uh, trying, to, trying her very best to, to make it all happen. So I deceive you into thinking I'm some kind of man of the world, as they say? But you're the one who's being deceived, Colm. Because I don't want a man like that. Anymore. This is a, a love story of the purest form, really. It's just uh, the unavoidable attraction of two people that find each other by accident. But then their own worlds come in and um, pull them in their own separate ways. And these people enjoy themselves very much. They deserve each other in a way, but they can't really have each other because of the geography, maybe you could say, of the relationship. One is a city girl, the other is an island man. What, what, I, what I really love about this play is that it's about two people who are desperately trying to find ways for each to work, but they're both in completely different worlds yet they're madly in love with each other. And while it might be sad, it's human. So it's, it's relevant and timeless. This is a chance to be respected and maybe even paid for it. I don't know, Timothy. Are you a masochist? Pardon? A masochist, someone who likes to suffer. Right, I would think I am. That's what's become of me all right. What did you expect? I've been too long off the sea and there's nothing for me to do but remember it. I do love you very much, my darling, and I suppose I'm dying a bit because of that love. A slow way of dying. You should come to see Sea Marks because it's unique. Irish love story. What could be more romantic than a craggy Irish fisherman along the rocky shores of Galway falling in love with a with a sophisticated beautiful girl from the Midlands of England and they meet and it's magic and then they and then they come together. It's it's a wonderful love story and I'm a sucker for a love story but with this one my cup runneth over. What do you call that you're wearing? A night dress. I suppose there's nothing more to say. No, Colin. 